I'd like to take a quick moment to talk about computer maintenance. When many people hear this term, they think about things like disk defragger and virus checkers and stuff like that. But today I'm going to open up this case and show you what's really going on in there. Let's go in and take a real close look at another problem that needs to be addressed on a regular basis. On the floor of your computer, you'll find a thick layer of dust that's accumulated. This is drawn in by the equipment cooling fans on your computer. Now, dust on the floor of your computer is not necessarily bad, but if we take a look at the other horizontal surfaces, like this circuit card, you'll find the same problem, quite possibly even worse because of the electrostatic charge on the card. Not only will this blanket of dust act as a blanket, causing your electronics to run a lot hotter, but zooming in on one of the chips on this circuit card, we can see some of the dust is actually laying across several electrical contacts at the same time. And if we're unlucky enough that some of these dust particles are conductive, that's going to cause major problems inside your computer. And speaking of major problems, let's take a look at this item right here, the CPU. Today's modern CPUs have so many transistors inside of them, they run extremely hot. So hot, in fact, they need cooling fins and their own dedicated cooling fans. Well, what this fin and fan arrangement's actually created is a dust filter. The fan pulls high-speed air through the fins, and the small gaps in the fins captures all the dust that's pulled through them. Eventually, your fins will completely plug up with dust. When this happens, your CPU loses its cooling power, and then it burns up. The fix for this is extremely easy. Periodically, clean out the inside of your computer. I found the easiest way to do this is with compressed air. With compressed air, though, you want to be careful not to blow directly into the fan and let it spin. You want to hold the fan while you're blowing through it. 90 PSI can cause a fan to spin awfully fast and possibly damage it. Normally, I clean my computers out once a year. But with how dirty this computer was, I think I'm going to change that to once every six months. And finally, if you don't have access to compressed air, try using a vacuum cleaner. It's better than nothing. 